I am Adam Groon. I am a disabled artist and disability advocate. I am wanting to do a video film documentary project that I hope can spread awareness about disability issues more than uh, the video work I've already done and have shared on YouTube. I'm hoping to make a documentary with some help from other filmmakers and uh, help spread the message a lot wider uh, to, to hear more of us a project. Uh, continue watching this video and you will see a demo of some of the video work I can do from my chair which I do hope to include in in the documentary. So to find out more if you're interested, please continue watching my wonderful video. Thank you. I am looking for a filmmaker or a few to help me collaborate on a documentary project I would like to do on myself on the issues and barriers I face as a person who uses a power wheelchair and a person with a disability. Because I have only partial use of one hand, I face a lot of obstacles trying to gain either work or figuring out where to take my future. I have become an, uh, become an artist who likes to work in many disciplines, uh, especially video and photography and art. But because of my disability, I have not as yet gotten enough experience in either of these fields to be able to apply, to apply for funding myself for my disability advocacy work. I am working on many media project looking at, at the accessibility and one of the projects I would like to do is a documentary of higher caliber than I could produce myself. I do have video and media experience and I would like to collaborate at all levels and use the production of this documentary as a learning experience. I have um, edited and produced a few videos, but I have had trouble running most editing equipment myself. I do have a GoPro camera that is capable of professional quality footage up to 4K XR to be exact, but I don't have the computer power needed to process this high quality data. So, uh, so that is why up until now, I have just done most of my video work in automatic settings 1080p because I d don't have the time to white balance and stuff. Uh, uh, And my computer can easily process that on my own with my computer that has an accessible mouse and accessible keyboard. Unlike most editing suites at most companies here and around Toronto, which I cannot use. Which is okay for most of the media projects I've been doing, which up until now have been mostly um, projects that I've just put on YouTube. I do believe to make a stronger documentary that would be better to work with at least another individual to give me another camera operator, editor, and somebody to collaborate on the storyline. Just somebody to give another perspective and maybe help steer the story in a better stronger direction. 
I would like to share in some of the production credit because again they're gonna be hard enough for me to earn and I, w I would like to at least be able to put my name to this accomplishment. I do recognize this project could take a while to produce from the time when I pick my um my film staff or produ producer. Because I will still need to find funding, which I have been unable to get myself because I don't have enough experience for most of the conventional funding models. And with my ODSP, the way it's arranged now, I can't even really crowdsource directly myself, so I would need a producer or somebody to handle the money. My eventual goal is to get this documentary into a festival like Hot Docs or other film festivals to help spread the, the message of accessibility issues and barriers with a wider audience, and I think uh, it might help it. It might uh, get seen by a wider audience than my YouTube channels could ever dream of. If you are interested, please contact me at arcoon at gmail.com or on Twitter at arc23. Thank you very much. Feel free to look at some of my other um, video work. Um, I've included links to my YouTube channel and everything. So um, feel free if you have any questions. If you're interested, I would definitely love to chat with you. Thank you. Um, thank you very much. Uh.